these Enlightenment philosophers and scientists all start writing down their work and then sharing it widely, thanks to newspapers and periodicals. And because of the Protestant Reformation, the public is more literate than they were before, and now they're reading all this newspaper and information, and there's a growing public opinion on ideas and events. A lot of these Europeans, maybe for the first time, are like, oh, there are other parts of the world, look at that. All of these ideas start to challenge previously held social norms in Europe. And because art imitates life, we of course see this reflected in painting. Here we have The Milkmaid by Vermeer. It's a piece by Rembrandt, and I mean an anatomy lesson. An anatomy lesson? Talking about enlightened and scientific ideals pervading through society? We actually see a new focus on political participation represented in art, like this one by Jacques-Louis David. Kings are still using Baroque art and music to demonstrate their power. The economy is doing okay for wealthy people, so they're buying fancy things for their home, like porcelain. Remember, Europe's learning about the rest of the world now. 